Hi everyone, welcome to researchmd.com. We got a great presentation today. We're going to talk about like how does this COVID-19 mRNA vaccine causes myocarditis, right? There's a lot of reports about myocarditis, about the vaccine, um, one of the complications. Again, my name is Premier Charyat. I work as a director of research. Um, I teach medical students, medical residents. I'm a program director, internal medicine residency program, and also um, assistant professor of medicine. Now, let's look at it. Well, how do they make this uh, mRNA vaccine? mRNA is a form of RNA required for protein synthesis. I think everybody knows that, right? Information in the genes used by the MR2 you, to build a blueprint for producing the protein cells. After it produced the protein, they rapidly degrade. And the one thing we need to understand, this vaccine mRNA does not penetrate the nucleus. So DNA is not affected. A lot of people are thinking it can affect the DNA. So there's no effect on the DNA. Now, what is our pathogenesis in the vaccine um, induced myocarditis? This mRNA vaccine, it causes activation of the aberrant, innate, and acquired immune response also. Exposure to tall cell receptor, and the body detect this as a, you know, the body, this detect by the immune system thinking it's an antigen, and then boom, all this inflammatory cascade comes into play. IL-1 receptor antagonist and um, IL-5, IL-6 and all this cytokine storm and start attacking the myocardium, then you get myocarditis. Wanted to bring uh, uh, your attention, we just finished this research study, kind of published and looked at the 40 cases of people with uh, vaccine-related myocarditis. The link is given below if you want to take a look at it. In this study we found, just a brief summary of what we found, uh, 26 cases reported with the Pfizer vaccine, 65%, and 12 cases were like Moderna vaccine, 30%. So please read that article. Uh, thank you so much for joining us today. We'll be back with another presentation. Please subscribe to our channel. Thank you.